Hi, I'm Brian Sear. And I'm Jeff Holquin. We're going to be talking about moving from the floor up in home construction. So taking you through what's required to make this thing that we're standing on, some of the elements that are required to make that happen, plywood and jet. Two by four. Two by four, there you go. So stay with us, you're gonna learn a lot. We're gonna take, take care of everything, everything from floor to finish and everything in between. All right, Jet, we spent a lot of time talking about excavation, foundation, concrete. Now we gotta get into the wood. Right. Okay, so what's the first thing you notice when you're looking outside here? What's going on? Well, I see that this uh, foundation's been capped. <laughs> exactly. So we've got rim joists here. Now here, we're actually standing on the subfloor. So the subfloor is the basis of the whole home, the whole home. So what the builder does is that the foundation is all backfilled all the way around the concrete. Then the whole main floor is capped with a system of, we call these rim joists, and then plywood on the top to seal everything up, okay? Then we build up from here. So we'll talk about exterior wall framing, interior wall framing, roof systems, and materials. So Jet, we've come up to the capped main floor system and we have a series of red lines that are going on with chalk. Tell us what's happening. Right, so the, what the builders done is they've come up here and they've lined up these nice big long red chalk lines to lay out the exterior and interior walls and the reason that they've actually done it now at this stage is because this is all nice and cleared out, right? So it's really easy to line up these perfect long nice big red lines. Exactly. So when the, when the framers come up here to snap lines, they've got these big, long, you know, piece chalk strings, right? So when you've got no piles of lumber or anything in the, in the floor system, it's very easy to lay them out nice and straight and even so you get a perfect job. Then when the lifts of lumber are delivered, they can start building the walls and standing them up. You'll see the exterior line in here and then your interior walls coming this way here, intersection point. This is obviously some form of a closet, what have you in here, 24 inches, which is about right. And, and that's exactly how the starting of the framing begins, snapping chalk lines. 